Hello and welcome back to Mega Reacts. So today we're going to be reacting to a brand new show, White Collar. This show was voted on in my Patreon poll for what new show I should start. And it'll be my first new show of 2021. So what I know about this show is not much. I know it came on the USA Network. I used to see ads for it every once in a while when watching Burn Notice, which one of my favorite shows ever. So I know it's about white collar crime, uh, a criminal who works with the FBI. That's it. So I kind of know the premise, a criminal who does something with white collar crimes. I don't know if he's a a uh, banker or a, what other white collar crimes are there? All I can think of are like embezzling banker type people, <laughs> but uh, I know someone like that worked with the FBI solving crimes but we're just gonna hop right into episode one the pilot see what the show's all about i've heard good things so come on this journey with me but before you do please like comment share subscribe patreon link in the description below this is mega let's get into it okay This facial hair kind of grows like mine. Doesn't really feel in too good, does it? What's he doing? Oh, what? Is that a guard uniform? That is. Ha ha. Very cool. Dude, you're almost out. Oh, you got someone's card too? Ha mm. <laughs> ha! Very good. Neil Caffrey. Bond forger, counterfeiter, security, art. Right. Alright, he's a he's a jack of all trades. <laughs> <laughs> Got a couple bucks. It's only five bucks, man. I'll give you three. Wow, we're seeing how far he can get with like three dollars. God, this guy's good. Back in a month. Uh, 100 bucks and a car. Wow. Hey, that's the uh, doctor from Lucifer that almost killed Chloe. Drop three. Before. Wait! Oh. <laughs> you okay? Ah, 10,000 man hours to get this close to the Dutchman and you blow up my evidence. Agent Buck, how'd you know it was gonna do that? 324. Give me your phones. What's it spell? FBI. Oh. <laughs> FBI. Yeah, FBI. Apparently he knew we were coming. You think so, Copernicus? Somebody wanna wanna tell me what this is? Huh? Anybody? Nobody knows what it is. Great. Look at you. How many of you went to Harvard? <laughs> Don't raise your hands. Don't. Oh, I see where this is going already. Ah, Diana, look at this. Apparently our Beat boy someone with some street smarts. Very cool. Agent Burke, I'm Thompson, U.S. Marshals. Appreciate the help. Shaved his beard just before he escaped. Neil doesn't have a beard. The inmates who photograph each morning as they exit their cells. I hardly recognize him. Yeah, I think that's the point. This morning. Yes. Turn the series back. When did he first start growing the beard? That's it. When he stopped shaving. Yep. I don't know everything that that's when he decided to break out. He had a visitor.
Kate Moreau. You know her? Yeah. I do. Right, she's breaking up. I assume can we get a lip reader in here? I'll save you the trouble. Adios, Neil. It's been real. She come back next week. Uh, she never came back. Uh, she's already gone. Moved out. Leave you a message in that. The bottle is the message. It only took you a month and a half to escape the supermax. Damn impressive. <laughs> All clear. Subject identified and unarmed. Roger that. We surrounded. How many? Including my agents and the marshals. <laughs> Everyone! We're gonna give you another four years for this, you know? I don't care. What's it worth if I tell you what this is? Is it worth the meeting? What are you talking about? If I tell you what this is right now, Will you agree to meet me back in prison in one week? He's already working another angle. Yeah. Just the meeting. I like this guy. Okay. It's a security fiber for the new Canadian hundred dollar bill. Mm. Hey. Tonight. Is that yeah. Kelly from Saved by the Bell? There's more to this. More to this than some lost love. Some side angle he's mm. playing. So you're suggesting he escapes a maximum security prison, knowing full well that you'd catch him, just so he could trick you into letting him out again? Wow. To working theory. Yeah. If, if that is the case, it's this so dude's brilliant. I believe a man would do that for the woman he loves. Neil just bought himself four more years in prison. For what? For what? If you were Neil, you wouldn't have Trick run question. For me? Trick question. <laughs> Let me see it. You understand how this works? I'm being released into the custody of the FBI under your supervision. There you go, snake eyes. Thank you. <laughs> He's like, I'm not staying here. <laughs> I love it. Man, do I have to stay here? Cowboy up. You find something better? Take it. What about clothes? I'm wearing my entire wardrobe. You like thrift stores? There's one at the end of the block. Huh? Look at it. It's not. Oh, look at her. <laughs> you can't get that in prison, do you? Uh, no, you don't. I've come to donate these. Mm -hmm. Those are fantastic. Oh, they belong to my late husband, mm. Byron. He really did. Great taste in clothes. Oh, man. Thank you. Husband played poker with Cy Devore. He certainly did. And so did I. <laughs> I don't know who that is. Oh, yes. Well, but it sounds impressive. Once in a while on a hand. And I was good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad to see you appreciate these. I was hoping someone would. Do you live nearby? Not far. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, you know this only works because he's not only charming, but in incredibly attractive I'm here for a <laughs> he is he is a good oh, looking yeah, fella yeah. Gotta be <laughs> you're gonna be blown away at what this guy can do he is a pro good life lets you hide you're early I'm shaking a lead at the airport we got a hit on Snow White I went to the thrift store like you suggested and June lady with the dog we met was donating her late husband's clothes. We hit it nice. off. She had an extra guest room. Hmm. You said if I found a nicer place for the same price, I should take it. Yes. I did take yes, it. you did. All this for 700. Yep. But help out around the place. Oh, sure. Feed the dog. Yeah, watch the Jag. Watch your granddaughter from time to time. She's got you babysitting. <laughs> uh, not quite. Wow, she is gorgeous. <laughs> uh. Perfect. Even freaking <laughs> coffee is perfect. <laughs> <laughs> That's not jewelry on his ankle, you know. He's a felon. 
Mm -hmm. So was Byron. He probably reminds her of her late husband. Man, he wears that suit though, don't he? I gotta lose weight so I can wear a suit like that. <laughs> My goodness. You're upset. Oh, goodness. What was that? Look, you tell me which rule I broke and I will thumb it back to prison myself. For starters. I work hard. I do my job well. And I don't have a $10 million view of Manhattan that I share with a 22-year-old art <laughs> student while we sip espresso. <laughs> Why not? Why not? <sighs> because I'm not supposed to. The amount of work I do equals certain things in the real world, not cappuccino in the clouds. Look, I will find out where June Biden is. <laughs> it's not about the coffee. It is. No, it's not. Uh.